Today, we're gonna to show you how to remove the factory plastic rear bumper from a Jeep Gladiator. Stay tuned. And welcome back to the Northridge 4x4 Do-It-Yourself Garage. And yes, today we're gonna to be showing you how to remove the factory plastic rear bumper from the 2020 or 21 Jeep Gladiator pickup. Now, why would you wanna remove the factory plastic bumper? Well, that's to put an aftermarket bumper on, of course. But first, we gotta get this out of the way. Now we're gonna start right back here at the license plate. You need to start with a 10 millimeter socket. Underneath the license plate, you'll find these two bolts. They take a 16 mil socket. All right, starting here on the back side of the rear bumper, we've got all our wiring. We wanna reach up in here and pop these Christmas tree clips. And then we reach up on the back side here, we can press down the little lock and give this plug a wiggle. And off it comes. Then we come up here on the frame, pop out the little red clip, and then we can press down on the black tab and out comes the plug. And now we pop out this Christmas tree. And one more behind this bar. And now we can unbolt the bumper. We're gonna remove these two nuts right here. They take a 16 mil socket. Now with the nuts off the back and these two center bolts out, we can grab the bumper and slide her right off. On the back of the bumper, you have your license plate wiring that comes across. Depending on your aftermarket bumper, you may need to use this. You've also got your trailer plug here. For the trailer plug, we can just open these clips up a little bit. For our reverse wiring, just want to pop out all these little Christmas tree clips. Then on this side here, we've got a little plug. We can just work a little screwdriver right down in the slot. And the plug comes right out. And the same for the other side light. And then we got our harness and trailer plug ready to go to the new bumper. Now, if you need to remove your tow hook, for your aftermarket rear bumper, you have these two bolts here and they'll take a 21 mil. So that's all there is to removing the factory plastic bumper from the back of your Gladiator. And now it's ready for an aftermarket bumper of your choice. And so that's the question. What aftermarket rear bumper do you like for the Gladiator and why? Hit up that comment section down below and let us know. We'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching today. We'll see you again soon.